There are 33 sex offenders within a five mile radius of my house. I am absolutely not comfortable with my kids walking to school every day. Some parents with kids in the West Fargo School District say that they're shocked that certain neighborhoods will not have bus transportation. It's a story we first told you about earlier this month. Following that story, a parent collected hundreds of signatures in an attempt to make a difference. Valley News Team's Katie Opperly joined them at the school board meeting tonight where they presented their frustrations. I have no way of getting my kids home from school. Nearly 600 signatures have been gathered in support of increased bus transportation in the Osgood area. Monday marked the first day of classes in West Fargo and forced many parents to find alternatives to get their kids to school. I also only own one vehicle. It's a minivan. Uh, my husband has to take it to work and so I have no way of driving to the school. Parents feel their neighborhood should be one of the stops on West Fargo's bus route. There are a lot of kids that I've found out from families in our area that are also struggling with a way to get to school. They need that transportation. I was told I was going to get it when I registered my kids back in May. This area is more than a mile walk from school according to Google Maps and parents are worried about the safety of their children. Is it not unsafe? I don't want to take that chance. Stephen DeMarco says he just hopes the board takes their concerns into consideration. It's a mess. It's confusing. It's, it's last minute arrangements that a lot of people are having a hard time to make. And these parents say they're looking for answers. I know they can't fix the transportation right away. Hopefully they come up with something, you know, to help these parents out. Katie Opperly, Valley News Live. The West Fargo School Board said that they will take all of their concerns into consideration but made no decision tonight. Stick with Valley News Live for updates on this story.